Hey everybody, welcome back to some more X4. Today we're going to talk about drones. In 3.0, EgoSoft added the ability to actually control drones, which is uh, something you know I think everybody's been wanting. So I'm I'm here on my Cerberus, which can carry 12 drones. It currently ha it also has a docking bay, so I have a Ecl Eclipse park right in front of me on the docking bay. So the basics of drones on your ship screen here. There's a drone behavior section now. And there is a mode. Notice there's also a subordinate control. So this is my ship alpha. That's my eclipse right there. So you don't want to get those too confused. So say you're getting ready to go in for battle. These are your kind of options. You can kind of choose escort as one. Attack all enemies. Attack my current enemy. There's a bunch of options. And the status. So for example, we can do attack my current enemy. We don't have them, but let's go back and say we want to escort. We can try that. Okay, so now the ship, it lowered my uh, dock ship in order to start launching the drones. We will see them start launching right now. It's not a quick process. I, I only have the one bay and it really does launch them. And the same goes for landing. So, getting your drones out is not always quick. But let's start taking a look at what do we got here. So, we got a bit of an incursion going on. So, we will start making our way over to deal with that Xenon ship. You can launch while you're moving, as you can see right now. And the drones should be following us. And they are. However, our speed is a bit off because of uh, the drone launching. Did we lose that target already? No, we didn't. Alright. We can also, from the screen undock our uh, dock ship so we have to we go a little slower when that happens but we got that deployed and then we'll go in oh we crashed into us hey all right you can see on the little radar all of our escorts we're gonna <laughs> this is gonna be interesting I'm gonna turn off the HUD for this This is going to be a quite a battle. We just want to stay away from their main guns. Let's, let's look at the... Uh... Let's take a look at the view here. This is cool. We could get out on the deck and watch this battle if we wanted to. Alright, put the hunt back on. Get up nice and close. My drone should be arriving. We'll 
Take out that engine. Ooh, this is quite a battle. Got a behemoth over there, a couple behemoths. There we go, nice. Ooh. All right. So, there's some combat. Let's bring the defense drones home. So we can order our subordinate to dock and let's disarm the defense drones. Okay, so there we have the drones landing. Defense drone. This will take a little bit of a process here as we have to do it one by one. But you can, you can see the lights come on as they, that means something's going to happen and they're coming to land. And that is basic drone usage. Let me check. I want to check something here while this is happening. I've been really looking forward for some remote detonators and have not been able to get them, get them to drop. And that is still the case. Mm. I do have 45 space fly eggs though. So I think I can uh, craft some caviar. We will do that next. Got plenty of secure containers. I got. I can get lodestone easily. It's those remote detonators that are a pain. <coughs> okay, so that about does it for drone control. As you can see, it's it's pretty easy. Just remember, it takes time to launch them, and they do not have fast travel. So you should launch them closer to your target. They will launch on their. They they should launch on their own if you have certain settings set. But, you know, it's better to have them out before you go into the fight because, you know, then you know, it'll be easier fight, right? All right. Thanks for watching.